Limehouse would have cost a lot more, but word got out that he wouldn't be able to breathe. A veterinarian had checked his air passage and said that he wouldn't be able to get enough air. He did not suffer from lack of air. We had another colt named Heckle that was faster and caught on quicker and uh, actually had outworked him here. But Limehouse was a very intelligent horse that just came along steadily. And Limehouse went off at eight to one. I will never forget, in deep stretch, when Heckle began to falter, I, my heart sank, but I looked over on the rail and here came Limehouse barreling down the rail to win the stake. the first rider that was ever blessed with a chance to throw a leg over his back. He was always a great student. He was a kind of horse, you walk in the stall, he'd look at you and say, are you sure you're supposed to be in here? And I told him, yes, I'm sure I'm supposed to be here. Horses are like people, they're not all cut out for stardom. And uh, you have to recognize that at the appropriate time, after giving them every chance. When he went to Keeneland, um, my wife and I had the opportunity to drive up and, uh, and go visit him there. And uh, I was also galloping Heckle at the time, and I wanted to go see Heckle. And um, then, of course, Limehouse, and the assistant trainer there said, Oh, Billy, you're not going to recognize this horse. He's put on so much muscle, and he's just awesome. And he's going to be even better than Heckle ever thought of being. And I said, oh, I walked past his stall, and I couldn't believe the change in him. From when he left here, he was just a little high school kid. And then when I saw him up there a few weeks later, he just looked like this massive football player. Pedigree is vital, in my opinion. When the going gets tough, and you hit the 16th pole, and three or four of those babies are looking one another in the eye, I want mine to be able to look back and call on his mom and his daddy. First time he was led into the breeding shed, he knew exactly what to do. <laughs> and the first mare he was bred to, he has impregnated. He's very popular at $17,500 stud fee. He's going to be bred to 145 mares. And it couldn't happen to a nicer guy. <laughs> Is it courage, guts, determination, poise, character? It's just class. And what a fabulous thing it is to see it in a human being or to see class in an animal. So I thank you all for this fine honor for this fine horse who had class. The greatest thing you could say about Limehouse is that when you asked him the question, he would give you the answer.